Students from Arvin High School brought a piece of their culture to the quad this afternoon, putting on a traditional mariachi performance to mark the start of Hispanic Heritage Month. 23 ABC's Ruby Rivera tells us about the lesson behind the festivities. It's just how to be more connected with your roots uh, through music and whether it's mariachi, banda, norteño, anything, but really just the emphasis on being more connected to the culture. Mariachi instructor at Arvin High School, Jorge Lariz, says Friday's performance was part of the school's mariachi and folklore classes, where students not only learn about their culture, but get to be fully immersed in it. We're exposing them here to dancing, uh, mariachi, other art forms. We also have um, art that they get to draw. And then just uh, during the classes, we explain a little bit more about the history, um, where did it originate from, um, and then also doing these kind of events at the school. And Lariz says this is the first time her performance has been dedicated to celebrate Hispanic Heritage Month. A lot of students don't know the traditions behind their culture and it's really nice to be able to show them and see how much they appreciate it. Folklore and video production teacher at Arvin High School, Brenda Ruiz, says there's a lot of culture behind Hispanic Heritage Month, so it's not uncommon to see celebrations being held differently. Ruiz says they try to ensure that they're teaching students multiple ways of expressing their culture, but still keep the concept of music. Ruiz says teaching students about mariachi was a no-brainer since many kids grew up listening to it. I had a student who said her her mom didn't believe her that she was doing folklorico, so she came out to our first show and she was like, see mom, like I'm not just, you know, coming to school and doing nothing, like I'm, I'm involved. So the mom was very proud to see that her daughter was, was picking up on something that she had done when she was a child. Letty says he's grateful to know that these students have the option to immerse themselves with their culture and family roots. Some of them were connecting with like their grandparents learning how to play the guitar. Uh, they had someone at home that knew how to play it. So other than that, I think we're just bridging that connection with students at home too. School organizers say they're pleased with this year's turnout and plan to create a similar event for next year. But in the meantime, students are set to perform at different events. In Arvin, Ruby Rivera, 23 ABC News, connecting you.